What is going on guys and welcome back to another episode of Sims 4 Escape to Japan. In this episode we finally are going to find out who Faith picks. Will it be the current boy Benjamin Woodruff? Sensible, nice, calm, cooperative. Or will it be... I, I forgot his name. Jack Reacher, that's it. The tough, smart, intelligent, very tough, muscly guy. Find out next time on <laughs> Escape to Japan. We're not even there yet. Here we are, and we have no power, no power for me. Travel house power. And how about you start off this video by inviting Jack Reach around? That's if it lets you. Because it is late. Fairly late. He might be sleep he's sleeping. We're gonna to have to wait till tomorrow, but Benjamin is not here. That's all that matters. You got everybody asleep. <laughs> These two are just having some weird teenage a fun. If you didn't watch the last episode, she also met a little person of interest called Glenda Ree based off the Walking Dead character. <laughs> Fancy. You have work tomorrow. Oh, why does FP have work? We're gonna take a vacation day. Just because I don't want to proper. Set this out with a straight and who we're picking. Can you invite him over yet? In fact, go downstairs, go cook some breakfast. Oh, there is some food. Go eat some. Benjamin's returned home like a weirdo, probably been out cheating himself. Do as I don't think many people are rooting for Benjamin here. He's only been with us a few episodes, so they're not too close yet. And once you've done all that, you can invite him over. And you can see... He, he, he's like so close to the top. He, Benjamin's nowhere near. You can tell I've been playing the Sims for a while today. Look how lucky it is. Invite the current lot. That creature will be right over. Hey, good morning. Where is he? There he is, summoned out of mid nowhere. And you... She has chosen, and she unfortunately has... Well, not fortunate. She has fortunately chosen Mr. Jack Creature himself. Has She just feels a different level of passion. So, she's gonna go... It begins. She's gonna go break things off with poor Benjamin. Not the to be boyfriend. Is it under mean arguments? Friendly affection. Compliments. Gossip. 
deep thoughts. Ask to have science, baby. I really want to know what that is. Ask just to be friends. They still got all their romance, though. But there he goes. And Jack Creature will be moving in straight away, just so we can get to know him. So. There goes all their love. And that is their love gone. And poor Ben doesn't know what him. So I kiss them. So how about you friendly ask him to join household? Literally in front of him. Moving in together. So we have Jack Creature, Robert Sullivan, Glenn Ray, and Negan Smith. And we're going to take him. They have loads of money. Let's take eight grand. Thank you. Here comes Jack Creature, another Blonsom. And the first thing we need to do is age him up because he is a lot in fact no let's let them have woo first let them have some woo fun time upstairs arenio and then we'll age him up and then we'll get a look at him in cast This dog is like, why is there so many? He hates the dog. Why? But you can come over here. Who's cooking? Who's calling Faith while she's wooing? Go cook a chocolate cake. Oh. Not right now, Phil. No, and now I'm dead. I'm currently having woo woo. You will go do it. Deal. Oh. Oh, she be a naughty. Jack Reacher. He is very delirious. Look at him down there in that photo. Four centuries. <laughs> Add birthday candles. Blow them out. There he is. And the traits we actually gave him, if we go on the symbology, is self-assured, good, and genius. And you got the quick learner trait, because I gave him the nerd brain, just because he knows everything. Oh, you're so tired. Study hard. Study hard. Study hard. Well, how about while the kids are away, you do some more woos. There's no harm done. Oh, it's roof there. I was going to say, a hole in my house. At least you just have a passion. That they never had with Benjamin. And there they go. Oh, you poor thing. You want to go meet Glenn today, don't you? I know what you want. I know what you want, girl. Let me be a rebel, honey. 
Right. You are home and you are shade. Time to wear black. Oh my god, you're having a mood swing and you're wearing black too. Well, I'm actually going to make you happy just so we can go out on a date. Oh my god, this girl. How about you go on a little travel with, he doesn't exist. There he is, Glimmery. Why is she so emotional? What does Faith we want in? Oh, hello. How those two know each other? No idea. No idea. Not the shoddiest one indeed. Oh, Glenn may probably end up just being a starter boyfriend. It's just somebody for Indigo to get to know as she grows up. Which is, it's good. They may just, they may even make out as good friends. As it is, Indigo, they are going to the classiest places in Windenburg. But this is the nicest place to be. A library nightclub. It's a bit early for the nightclub. Let's go to the pool. Oh my god. Honey, know you love me and you know it makes me sad Just a cigarette like you always used to do to try to get some bit more of a friendship going and maybe a bit of romance he's turned up in his swimming clothes maybe in the excuse me is that who i think it is it is luna hello auntie who i've never met who is this guy did i I thought that Wolfgang guy. He's so weird. Right, how about Luna? You. Not Luna. Got thingy in my head now. How about you change into your swimming outfit, which is one of these two? This one. So, you know, maybe try to get his attention. She's having moose wings. Oh, there she goes. He's taking photos of himself. She's so sad. What romance things can you do? Gloomy compliment. Complain about classes. Oh, oh, hey, what? Good morning. Send some more gloomy compliments. This child would cheer up. He's gonna ask about woo woo. Oh, what you like? What are you like? Share a secret. Oh, Glenn's good. Look at Aunt there, crashing date. Mm 
Oh, I, all she can do is gloomy compliments. Not to focus at this moment, and what are you doing, child? Go away, Clente. Why is she boogieing there like an absolute freak? Stop chatting to the child. Chat to the boy. Where's he run off to? He's going in. Whoa, look at that pool. It is diving boards now, isn't it? Where is his spirit is fading away? Oh no. Why is she so sad? Let me add him to the group. Okay, it's already in the group. Maybe you send another gloomy compliment over. Is that all you can seem to be doing, child? Okay, it's going soon. And then you can actually do some proper romance and whisper about crush. Be like, Oh, there's somebody I like. It's you. He's like, no way. I like you, no. Share some photos. Complain about classes. Because you hate classes for some reason. Go away, moodlet. There we are. Now it's time. She can embrace. The bold pickup line. Ask about romantic interests, do we just do this in front of children? It's the right thing that we're gonna see this someday. Maybe a first kiss would suffice. Why can't you do anything more? Don't be leaving, boy. And he's left. Let's check the recording. I think I might end it here. So I hope you enjoyed this video. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye.